Good afternoon everyone, welcome to this week's digital newsletter. It's been another fantastic week in school. We came back on Tuesday this week to celebrate our Females Day. What we did was look at our curriculum and there were quite a lot um, of people that we celebrate, like famous artists and famous musicians that were all male. So what we decided to do was have a little look at different females in all the different fields. Children really, really enjoyed their work on that, so that was a fantastic start to the half term. Um, just to let you know about the competitions that are running at the moment, we've got our reading competition. This is really exciting to get one of the 15 spectator tickets for the football competition. So the children have all been given a special card and on that card they have to collect train tickets. They have to try and visit all of the host cities for the Euros. To be able to get their ticket to the next city, they needed to have read a whole new reading book. So all the, teachers, all the children have got to do is prove to their teacher that they have read their reading book. So they can do that any way they like. They can do an accelerated reader quiz, they can do a little book review, they can do a picture, any way at all. So as soon as they have read their book, they get their train ticket and on to the next city. So we're looking for the children who have gone the furthest. We're also looking for children that have really impressed us, even though they haven't got so far. So for example, if your child's got a huge long book, um, they won't be disadvantaged, they'll still have a chance of winning. So those 15 tickets are up for grads, so please encourage your children as much reading as possible to get round Europe to those host cities. Um, we've also got our attendance competition that started this half term, so dead easy that one, they've just got to be at school every day. Um, all the children at school every single day this half term will be at our attendance festival in the very last week of term in July. Okay. Um, there are quite a few trips being planned now that we're allowed. We're trying to get the children as wide an experience as they possibly can. So just have a look out for trip letters um, because they are going on in each year group this half term. Next week, quite a few things going on next week. It's the year four um, children's times tables check, the multiplication check. Nothing for them to worry about at all. They've been doing some practice ones in school. Nothing to be scared of at all, but they will be going on on Monday and Tuesday. So just encourage them as much practice on rock stars as possible. That would be brilliant. Um, can I also remind people with the warm weather, um, please make sure the children have sun cream and hats on really, really warm days. There were quite a few children on the field this week um, that didn't have, so please make sure that you send sun cream and hats with them um, and put that sun cream on in the morning, please. Can I also just ask everyone to be really, really vigilant with COVID rules? Um, I know we feel like we're relaxing a little bit. However, rates at the moment, as you've probably seen in the press, are going up quite dramatically in our area. The last thing we want to do is to have to send any of our bubbles home. So please, please be making sure that mask wearing and dis keeping your distance um, still goes on because it's really, really important that we keep it out of school, please. Okay, I hope everybody has a fantastic weekend. Enjoy the sunshine. Um, and I look forward to welcoming the children back on Monday morning. Thank you.